Well, here you go, friends. Here's a moment. <laughs> oh, I'm telling you. Today, yeah, um, at, at work, I, I don't know, I was walking, you know, doing my thing, uh, uh, the, the, the usual routine of chores. Uh, I was doing housekeeping a lot today. And, you know, I, just thinking to myself, it's, it's once you get into the groove, it's kind of, well, you have, you have time to, you don't have to concentrate so much on the work as concentrate on your thoughts. And I was thinking, in fact, I think I woke up thinking this today. Gee, this is my last day of being uh, 74. Tomorrow I'm going to be 75, meaning this coming, uh, this is Monday, uh, Tuesday. I said, oh, gosh, boy. And, and I was going over in my life, you know, the various things I've done and all that. And I said, well, boy, I'll be into the uh, uh, going on the, you know, the... Uh, uh, well, getting over 70, I'll be 75 and, and over. And I, I was thinking, gee, I feel pretty healthy and all that. Reasonably sharp for an old, <laughs> an old timer. And, um, and then, I don't know, I was telling people, uh, I was telling folks at work, I was telling uh, different people I ran into, boy, yeah, tomorrow, big day and all that. Turning uh, the big seven, five. And then all of a sudden, all of a sudden it hit me. Yeah, I will be turning 75, but not tomorrow. The birthday is a month away. June 18th. For some reason, I thought we were already into June. And then I, and I kept trying to tell myself, yeah, of course it's June. It has to be June. Please make it June. And it wasn't. No, it ain't June. That's it. I, I, what got me thinking about it was Memorial Day. We haven't even done Memorial Day yet. You got to do that. Then you get June. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, so I had to go around telling everybody, you know, hey, the, the, the birthday thing for tomorrow? No. <laughs> it's still a month off. Oh, I could have died. And it's... Uh, the, I don't know. <laughs> you just scratch your head over such things. What's what is uh, at least comforting is I I remember the uh, the words of my cardiologist because I remember he was saying, "Well, you know, you're getting up there. How are you doing? You know, it's, I, I'm on a treadmill, you know, running, getting my heart checked." He says, "Hey, your heart's doing well, doing okay, yeah." And but he says, "So how's it going?" I said, well, I feel healthy, as you can see. He says, yeah, you're doing great. I said, about the only thing is, is I feel like I'm too forgetful. He says, well, join the club. I said, yeah, but, you know, I, gosh, my, my mom had Alzheimer's. She died from that, and that was, boy, that was awful. And, uh, you know, and I know other people that have gotten it, and, man, I don't want that. And uh, he says, well... He says one thing, I, he says one basic rule, at least us doctors go by, is, is that if you know you forgot and you realize you forgot, well, then it's, it's just old age. He says when, when you start not realizing you forgot or you know, insisting that you, you have it right, no. Then he says then you got, yeah, that's, that's more the, the serious stuff. I said, well, no, I, I always know, or someone points it out to me, and after a little bit of thought, I realize, yeah, they're, they're right, I was wrong. He says, well, you're okay. Keep running on that treadmill. I want to check a little bit more of your heart there. He says, your heart's in good shape. <laughs> he says, you ain't about to have a heart attack, at least not yet. Man, your heart's in good shape. What are you doing? I said, I work in a supermarket. He says, well... God, he said, I'm going to start telling people to go work at a supermarket. Can, do they start you off? You know, if, if, uh, if you were to ask nicely, would they start you off just moving the light stuff and they could work up? I said, well, you usually start off part-time, and then you, know, you get more and more hours as you get more experience. So, it, you know, and I, no, one scream, you know, no one stands over you with a whip. Uh, you, know, you, you, you go as best you can, that's all. That's about all anyone can ask. He says, you're fine. <laughs> he, he says, 
do you know what aisle like the cream cheese is? I said, well, I know where it sits in the dairy case. We don't have cream cheese elsewhere in the store that I know of. There, there might be some kind of cream cheese. It doesn't have to be um, refrigerated. But if it has to be refrigerated, it's in, in uh, the dairy section I keep an eye on. He says, see? He says, you're fine. So now keep, uh, I'm going to raise the uh, angle of the, uh, <laughs> I'm going to raise the angle of the uh, treadmill and I'm going to speed it up a bit. You ready? I said, yeah, I guess I am. Let's go. And uh, after, uh, yeah, after that conversation had to stop because I was getting a little winded, but anyone would. My God, the guy had it like I was climbing the Matterhorn at 40 miles an hour. Jeez. So, like I say, eh, it's so much fun getting older. Although I got I to gotta admit, looking back, I can't kick. I can't kick. No, not too bad a life. So far, so good. Anyway, I'll see you later, friends. Thank you, and, uh, well, God bless. Okay, bye now.